The Apple Watch Series 11 is still months away, but anticipation is already building over the potential upgrades it might bring over its predecessor. Last year, the Series 10 introduced one of the biggest design changes in years, featuring a larger display that even surpassed the Apple Watch Ultra 2. Apple also made the watch 10% thinner, making it sleeker than before. However, some users were disappointed that battery life remained the same despite the reduced thickness, as maintaining the previous thickness could have allowed for a bigger battery. Overall, the Series 10 was well received for its refined design, but the unchanged battery life left some room for improvement. One of the biggest questions surrounding the Series 11 is whether Apple will finally introduce a built-in glucose monitoring sensor. This feature has been rumored for years, with reports suggesting that Apple had reached a proof-of-concept stage as early as 2023. However, achieving medical-grade accuracy is a major challenge, as even a small margin of error could lead to incorrect readings with serious health implications. Apple has continued its research, even introducing an internal app to help prevent diabetes, hinting at future integration. While this progress is promising, there have been no strong leaks or confirmations suggesting that the Series 11 will include this feature, making it unlikely that we'll see it in this year's model. However, according to Bloomberg's Mark Gurman, the upcoming Apple Watches could introduce blood pressure monitoring. If Gurman's insights hold true, the latest models might detect early signs of hypertension a condition that often goes undiagnosed but is responsible for nearly 13% of global deaths. Aside from that, the Series 11 could bring refinements to existing health sensors. Apple previously had to disable a sensor in the Series 9 due to patent issues in the US, while the rest of the world retained full functionality. There is speculation that Apple may finally redesign and reintroduce this sensor with the Series 11. Additionally, there were reports of a new heart rate sensor planned for the Series 10 that never materialized, which could potentially make its way into this year's release. Beyond that, Apple Intelligence has yet to make a significant impact on the Apple Watch, though the notification summaries in iOS 18.1 hint at its potential, and many hope for its full integration in the Series 11. Other anticipated upgrades include a transition from 4G LTE to 5G for faster connectivity, the launch of Watch OS 12 with a more efficient S12 processor, and expanded customization. Battery life remains a common concern, with users hoping for improvements beyond the single-day charge seen in the Series 10, especially for sleep tracking. Apple traditionally unveils its new watches in September, alongside the iPhone. If the company follows its usual schedule, the Series 11 will likely be announced in early to mid-September 2025, with availability following about 10 days later. As for pricing, it is expected to remain the same as the Series 10, starting at $399 for the base GPS model, 